Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Welcome to part 10 and let's play Legend of Lagaya, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, let's head for this path to the Mist Generator, even though we're not going to the generator yet. Usually we go this way just to get the treasure chests. Fun! Look! The mist! Come see it! I, I see the mist. It's misty, of course. Just beyond this valley is the Mist Generator. The mist produced by the mist generator spreads out into the areas beyond the valley. I want to destroy the mist generator! I want to get rid of the mist! Noah, we should slow down. Oh, she pissed now. The mist here is too thick. My power is almost too weak to keep us from succumbing to the mist. Noah clearly wants to go. If we only had a little more Genesis tree power. Just a little more. Aw, don't be sad. Fine. Let's find another Genesis tree. If we find it. Then we could pass through here and destroy the Mist Generator. You going on mood swings or something? First you're sad, then you're mad, then you're right happy. Ooh, a Phoenix. That's good for reviving someone. Luckily, we never had that problem yet. Okay, the monastery is over here, I believe. There's another path to the mist generator, which also has another treasure chest. Let's go there first. Yeah, the mist is very thick. Oh, here's a new enemy! <laughs> an ostrich, of all things! Yeah, an ostrich. Okay, Gimard's at level 7, Vera's at level 4. It's always a good idea to level up as much as you can. Ha! Huh. Punching an ostrich in the neck. That is so boss of you. Alright, we're gonna have ourselves a deep fried ostrich. Here it tastes like chicken. Down now, I'm gonna burn ya. If you survive Noah's attack. Oh, it just broke its legs. Oh, and they're no back together. Like, isn't that awesome? You get to fight ostriches here. I mean, isn't anyone's dream to punch an ostrich in the neck? At least once. Preferably while hungry. Well, that's not really my dream. I don't really think about beating up an ostrich. I got other things to worry about. In real life. Even though I don't really worry about much at all. Okay, so this path should have a treasure chest too. It's on this side, apparently. Ooh, life water! Okay, life water, I believe, boosts your HP by 16. Ooh, clearly no one needs it the most. Just so she can catch up. Her longevity is pretty low. That's why I put the defender chain on her. Okay, even though we're walking around areas with mist, we're not going to run into any Seru. Up oh, here are some new enemies, Lippian and Frog. Okay, you can take out the frog with any attack except for upper. And I think lower fails too. So left and right tends to work. You gotta be careful with Lippian and take it out first, because even though it's, it, it is pretty fast, and it might try to paralyze you with Kiss of Death. Thankfully, Kiss of Death doesn't outright kill you, but it will make your life difficult. Ah, poisonous tongue. I got Venom status on. 
Vera should take care of that. Oh, guess I won't get a chance to use it. Oh well. I'm guessing poison wears off or venom wears off at the end of the battle. Let's see. Oh yeah, it does. Condition, yeah, it would have said venom if I was still inflicted. So this must be the monastery. We made it. Let's see what we can find here. Seems to be having a mist problem. Ah, there we go. I don't believe it! I rush out thinking that some sailor were up to no good, and I find human visitors. Well then, come with me. I'll introduce you to everyone at Byron. Um, yeah, please. Let's get the place well ventilated. I'm so glad you came. It's been a long time since Byron Monastery has had any real human visitors. I never thought anyone would come here while I was guarding the gate. You really surprised me. Wait. They're in the middle of the training. When it's over, I'll introduce you to Master Zopu. Yes, that's some serious training you got going. Stop right there! Good. We seem to have visitors. What a rare treat. That's enough training for now. You may attend to your individual tasks. Yes, sir! Let's go fapping! Get at you! Well, well! Welcome to Byron Monastery! Now then, let me get a good look at you. Uh, okay. I am Noah! With me here is Vaughn! Good to meet you, old man! How dare you call Master Zopu old man! Ha 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 ha! This young lady means no ill will. Master Teacher, stand aside. Yes, sir! Like, stand, stand over there. I see. Vaughn and Noah. How do you do? I am Zopu. Hmm. Your eyes are keen. And you have Seru. Alright then. We welcome you here. Tonight, we shall have a party in your honor. Until then, you may make yourselves at home inside the monastery. Yay, we got the party! Those things on your arms, are those Seru? Yes. So that's a Seru. I hear they give their wearer great strength. That's right! Ha ha ha! I want one of those Seru. I am Songi. Pleased to meet you. If you have an extra Seru, then let me have it. <laughs> he seems a little greedy. What a weirdo. Yeah, I agree. Okay, is there anything significant here? Yes, sir! One of the teachings of Byron is strength begets love. I don't think I just spat on the keyboard. Is there anything here at all? I really think so. Yes, sir! Even before the mist came, we were not any use of the power of the Seru! And that's why you guys never really had many human visitors. Yes, sir! In Byron Monastery, there are also women who have escaped the mist. Right now, those women are probably working in the upstairs kitchen and other parts of the monastery. Women in the kitchen? You guys run a very stiff monastery. Yes, sir! With training, humans can transcend the powers of the Seru! Okay, so the monks don't really use the Seru at all. Yes, sir! This is Byron, the god of this monastery! The fresh, clean air that flows from the mouth of Byron has kept us safe! Really? Oh, there was a power elixir in there. I think that increases your strength in battle. Yeah, it does. For one battle, at least. Yes, sir! Where the two of you come from? Uh, I came from Rim Elm. Ah, from Rim Elm! Tetsu, a fellow disciple, lives there. Is he well? He's good. Uh, try Noah's answer. 
Snowdrift Cave? Before the Seru, the monks of Byron were all over the world and sent back much information. But I've never heard of Snowdrift Cave before. Please excuse my ignorance. Uh, no. Vaughn? Or Vaughn? Is that you, Vaughn? May? <coughs> Vaughn? It is you, Vaughn. Don't you remember me? No, wait, Maya? Don't really recognize that face. Uh, Maya? That's right! I'm Maya from your realm! Vaughn, what a good memory! I'm impressed! You were still so young when I left the village! When Master Zofu told me a youth called Vaughn had come, I hurried here! I knew it was you! I knew it right away! You looked just like Val when he was young! <coughs> I'm so happy! Because of the mist, I thought I would never see anyone from Rim Elm again! You two are amazing! You must have had a hard time getting here! Not really. Oh, I almost forgot! I'm sorry, but Master Zopu asked me to help with the preparations for the party! I have to go now! There are so many things I want to ask you about, but then we'll have to wait until tonight! I want you to tell me about yourself, and about your village. <coughs> Bye for now! I'll see you later! She seems cheerful. So that's Maya! The one you've been looking for! Hmm... What energy she has! I couldn't get a word in! But I'm so glad I finally met her! So glad she's well! So glad you flap your arms like a chicken? Cool. Yes, sir! Master Zopu said to show our guests proper hospitality! And you do that. It doesn't look like it will matter which way I take. Either way, it's going to take me up here. Yes, sir! If you're looking for Maya, I, should, I believe she's in this room. But this is a woman's bedroom. Men are forbidden. You may not enter. Oh, you're horrible! What are you looking at? I'm a woman. I'm a woman, so I can go in. I don't mind you, Noah, but Vaughn will have to wait here. Okay, I'm going to talk to Maya. Um, it sounds pretty lively in there. I can hear a lot of laughter. Maya is very loving and hardworking. She's such a cheerful person. The monks of Byron think of her like a mother. The Byron Monastery doesn't allow Seru or women. I guess the mist has changed that rule. I like Maya too. She's a good person. Damn, you just knocked the door down. Hey, is something wrong? Uh, did you tell her about Juno or May? Uh-oh. I'm sorry, I forgot about that. But you can tell her later. I wanted to tell Maya, but she was so busy getting ready for the party. I don't want to be in her way. You can tell her later. But I want to tell her now. Fine. Yes, sir. Don't tell anyone I said this, but Master Teacher is the strongest here. Sangi is number two. Well, that's a rumor anyway. Rumor? But what? Oh, whatever. Master Zopu always says that the Age of Hope is close at hand. Age of Hope? Hey, what's up? This is a bedroom. If you're tired, I can prepare a bed for you. Do you wish to retire? Um, sure. Take your time. It's just a nap. Yeah, it was a brief nap, and it thoroughly refreshed me. There are these are the Sutra books of Byron. Uh, okay. Is there anything in this jar? I don't think so. So I'll just leave. Let me check out the other rooms. Yes, sir. Training is sometimes hard for me since I'm not talented like Master Teacher or Sangi. Well, then get to work. Ah, there's the memory statue. Yes, sir! This is the dining room! Okay. Alright, I'll go save. And there's a lot here to check out. Not that it's a bad thing. So that's the new spot. We took shelter here when the mist attacked. Um, good. 
Well, this place is full of good people. But sometimes I hate having to say yes sir and yes ma'am all the time. Get used to it. Uh, let's see. What do you have that I could want? Save your clothes that Vaughn could equip but not enough money. Uh, I guess we won't be able to buy anything. That sucks. What about items? Okay, healing flowers, healing blooms, and magic leaves are available thanks to the platinum card. Okay, we can increase our defense against elemental powers, but we don't have enough money. Man, it's so hard to get money at this point of the game. You may not give this much thought, but Sangha resents Master Teacher very much. Master Zopo and Maya are very distressed by this too. Yeah, Sangi seems like a pretty weird one. Oh, there's a phoenix in there. I heard that, that tonight there will be a party to welcome you. I'm gonna use all my skills to cook, cook up a feast for you. You do that. And there was medicine here. Alright then. Get ourselves saved. So what other places can I visit? As far as I know, I can probably just go this way. And there was nothing beyond there. Nothing hidden. So we shall press onward. Yes, sir! This is Master Zopu's room. Go on in. I will. Oh, and you got a healing bloom in there. Master Teacher's parents were both killed by Seiru monsters. Ever since then, he has hated the Seiru. For good reason. You said your names were Van and Noah, right? Did you listen to what the people of Byron had to say? Yes. I see. Well then, before the party begins, tell me what you heard. Tell me what you heard about the Seiru and about the mist. Okay. Alright, here's what happened. So that's what happened. Juno, he... He was killed by a Seiru! So Vaughn, you came all the way here for May's sake? <coughs> yeah? Maya, don't cry. Cheer up. It's not like you to cry like that. Well, you don't really know her. That's sweet of you to try to cheer me up. Still. It's also frustrating that I couldn't be by Juno's side. I loved him so. All along, I thought I would see him again someday. And now it's too late. I'm so sad. I'm sorry, Vaughn. I'm sorry, Noah. I'm sorry for crying like this. Maya, come to Ramel with us. May is there. I'm sorry, Noah. I just want to be alone now. I need time alone to think. Aww. It's so sad. Well, let's party. When Maya's sad, it makes me sad too. Sad and lonely, Vaughn. Okay, then just go in my stomach. Yes, sir! Maya is very cheerful and merry when she speaks, but sometimes she seems sad and lost in thought. Perhaps she is thinking of her homeland of Rim Elm. Well, her husband did get killed. This is supposed to be a party, but everyone is so serious. Well, duh, it's one of those serious parties. A Seru that's not affected by the mist. I wouldn't do for one. They say that's a Ross, there's a, that a Ross Seru sleeps inside something called the Genesis Tree. With a Seru like that, I'd show a master teacher who's really boss. Ha ha ha. Anyway, don't you mind me. But, but it's hard not to mind you. You seem so greedy and selfish. Yes, sir! Vaughn, Noah, don't tell me you're leaving, are you? Uh, no. Good. Master Zofu will be here shortly. Until then, please mingle with the others. I'll try my best. Maya would always tell me about the family she left back in Rimelm. But on the other hand, at Byron, Master Teacher and Sangir are like sons to Maya. Really? Yes, sir! This is such a fun party! When the mist clears, we'll have even more fun! Everyone's talking about the great deeds of you two. Well, we did do great stuff, after all. Yes, sir! Those are saber on your arms, aren't they? Yeah. I don't like it. I despise those creatures and those who depend on them. Well, 
Suck it up. Hey! It's night time, so I can't let you pass. Jeez, fine. Sangi is always watching and studying Master Teacher. To think that the two of them were once such great good friends. Maya is very concerned, and often comes to me to talk about it. Well, nope, that much is true. Ah, oh, there's Opu. I just saw Maya walking around crying. You didn't tell me before, but I want you to be honest with me now. Fun, Noah. You two came here to take Maya back to Rim Elm, am I right? Um... Yes? Such fortrightness. Ha <laughs> that is good. Young people should be frank. I too shall speak frankly. I have a favor to ask of you. I have heard that you used that, that raw Seru to revive the Genesis trees in Rim Elm and... In Mount Rikuroa. You rid those places of the accursed mist. Actually, there are two Genesis trees near the Byron Monastery. Will you revive them as well? Sure, why not? Ah, I thank you both. I must tell everyone immediately. All of you! Listen! They have just agreed to revive the Genesis trees. Hooray! Hooray for Vaughn! A toast to Noah! Once revived, the Genesis trees will rid us of the horrible mist. This is our chance. We must all help these brave visitors. The Genesis trees are in separate forests north of here, in West and East Vaz. Vaughn, tell me, which forest will you go to first? Um, I'm gonna go with West. West Vaz Forest, I see. Yes, that forest is closer to the origin of the mist. Yes, that is a wise decision. Master Teacher! Master Teacher, are you there? Yes, sir! Master Teacher, you will accompany these two to West Vaz Forest. But, but... Master Teacher, an Elder's order is the same as a command from Byron. Y yes, sir! Master Zopu, have you forgotten me? What is it, Sangi? Master Teacher is going to West Vaz Forest, then I will go to East Vaz Forest. I will go there to make sure that the Genesis Tree is safe. Songi, it is so unusual for you to volunteer like this. But that is good. I will give you monks to command. I am counting on you, Songi. Yes, sir. Now then, night has fallen. Let the party end. Well, that was quite a short party. Ha ha ha, they're all fools. I'm so brilliant. Once I get rid of those two brats and that macho moron, I'll get the Ross Seru from the Genesis tree in East Vaz Forest. Ha ha ha, I can't stop laughing. Alright, clearly Songi's up to no good. May Byron bless Songi on his journey to East Vaz Forest. Thank you. Leave everything to me. Why does he get the larger group? May Byron also bless Master Teacher and our two visitors on their journey to West Vaz. Vaughn, Noah, good luck to you both. Hey, Master Teacher, can I ask you something? What? Master Teacher is a weird name. It's not a name, it's a title. So, Master Teacher isn't your name? Then what is your name? Since you are not Byron Monks and need not call me Master Teacher, I will tell you. My name is... Eh, uh, well, it is Gala, of course. Look at him, he's so pumped. My name is Gala. Gala, that's an interesting name. Well, don't get too friendly. I hate Seru. <laughs> get used to it. We got Seru and we're gonna get used to them for a long time. Okay, can uh, Noah go see Maya again? Oh, there's no one in the bedroom, then why are you blocking it? 
makes little to no sense. Okay, before I stop the video, there is one more thing I can check out. Actually, I think I can go in here. Listen, everyone! You are wrong! This door leads to East Vaz Forest. To get to West Vaz Forest, you have to go through the opposite door. Opposite door? i probably check out Mr. Zopu's room. Oh yeah, I already got what was in there. You okay? Fine. Noah! It's about Rim Elm. Last night I was thinking. About May. About Juno. And about something else. I want to have a long talk with you, but now the Genesis tree is more important. Let's talk later, after you come back. Well then, good luck. I'll be praying for your safe return. Yes, sir! The wait is over. West Vaz Forest lies northwest of here. Good luck. Oh, thanks. Alright, so now the mess creeps out again because we just closed the way to the monastery. This way leads to the forest. Actually, before we go to the forest, there's one thing we can get over here. That's to the west. Let's go there right now. This is another pathway over to the mist generator. Which means there's another treasure chest here. This is the place. The mist is so thick, it's full of a warped madness and the presence of evil. The mist is flowing from a strange castle beyond this valley. This valley is the passageway for the mist created by the mist generator. Terra, can we go on ahead? No. I'm sorry, Noah. I know I'm a Raseru, but I don't have the strength now. I know. I'll find the Genesis tree and make you stronger. <coughs> then you can get through here with no problem. Who? Who are you talking to? To Terra. A Seru? You could talk to a Seru? Uh huh. Terra's nice. She's a good Seru. You're so strange. You give me the creeps. Both of you. But no matter. Now, on to West Vaz Forest, as Zopu instructed us. Okay. I'll do my best. Please do. An ivory book. Okay, Ivory Book is a pretty good accessory to have. Now I'm gonna put it on Noah. What Ivory Book does is increases your magic accrual, which means you're more likely to get a spell from a Seru that you absorb. Or more likely to absorb a Seru altogether. So before we go over to the forest, there is one more thing we can do, and it involves that cave over there at the end of the river. Let's go there right now. Oh yeah, the mist is thick. <coughs> oh god, we got Lipians and an ostrich. Alright, get to work. And seeing as how we got Gala for the first time, let's use some of his commands. Actually, he has no, no art points at all. He better spirit first. <laughs> Ah, there's a kiss of death. If it doesn't paralyze us. Aww. Luckily it was no one. She already had her turn. Clearly Gala needs to be stronger. We are using him for the first time. There we go. That's one Lippian down. Ow. No, because I'm no longer paralyzed. Cool. Alright, Gala, let's see what you can do. Jeez, you started at level 1. That's disappointing. 
I'll have you spear so Gala can get a turn in. Let's see, we're gonna go uh, down, up, left. It's about time you use an art for once. Ow. Alright, burn it. Say this would be a perfect time to train Gala before we even go into the forest. I definitely recommend it. Jeez, that's a lot of damage coming from an ostrich. Flying knee attack! Ah, eh, use an art this time. Or just punch it, kick it, whatever. There, that takes care of that ostrich. Okay, we're getting a nice bit of experience and some money. I could use a lot more money, though. Obviously. But we still gotta check out that cave. There it is, right here. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, we can't do much in Ancient Wind Cave, but the only reason you're here is to look for Seru. Because the mist is concentrated at this point. Oh, we can find Gimard and Theater. And this is pretty good for Noah, because now she can absorb the two of these. If we're lucky. Uh, let's try you. You go to work on that. Do it on the Gimard. Vance can still absorb theater, and so can Noah. At level 2, they must be stronger than their level 1 counterparts. So rather than use a palette swap, they're just going to use like the same name, but give it an extra level. And a different color as well. All right, Vaughn, let's see what you should do. Put that on the theater. And you, you should, let's see. Um, I don't want to go use too much power. I'm going to let Gala take a break. Ah, still alive. Oh, dear. Thunderbolt! Ooh, that's powerful. Yeah, yeah, finish! Yeah, they're still alive. I don't want Gala to get the kill because he doesn't have a raw Seru. I'm gonna use his turn to heal Gala now. And as long as he's spiriting, he at least will be safe with extra defense. Yes, I absorbed it. Now Noah can use Gimmer. Now let's see if Vaughn can get Theater. It's worth a shot. There, now we got you fully healed. All right, let's go. I'll just use something simple. And the rest of you is spirit. And let Vaughn do all the work. Yeah, yeah. Is this gonna be enough? No, we didn't absorb it. Either we just weren't lucky, or we overkilled it. But Gala gets to level 2, which is good. Sally, these are the only two Seru you can get here. Alright, I'm going to stop the video. Next part, I should have the Seru for everyone except Gala, and then we'll go into West Foss Forest. See ya, everybody.